This question says find the sum of digits of 100 to the power 10 minus 10. Very simple question. Let's see. First of all, when I say 10 to the power 1 minus 1, it is equal to what? It is equal to 9. So how many digits are there? There is just one digit. Right. Similarly, 10 square minus 1. That is 100 minus 1. That is 99. So it is just two digits. And both of them are 9's. 10 to the power 3 minus 1. 10 to the power 3 is 1000 minus 1. That is 999. So this has 3 digits and all of them are 9's. If it is 10 to the power 4 minus 1. 10,000 minus 1. That is 9999. So there are 4 9's. If it is 10 to the power... Uh, 5 minus 1. I know it is 9, 9, 9, 9, 9. 5 times 9 and so on. How do we use this in this question? Look at it carefully. Here we have 100 to the power 10. 100 is 10 square. So I'll write it as 10 square to the power 10 minus 10. So it becomes 10 to the power 20 minus 10. Take 10 common. It will become 10 to the power 19 minus 1. Now following this pattern, you know, if it is 10 to the power n minus 1, it will be 999. Nine, nine. How many times? n times 9. So n times 9. So this is going to be, this number is going to be 19 times 9. So it is 10 into 999 nine, nine, and n also 9. How many times? 19 times 9. Right? So, when you multiply 10, there will be a 0 in the end. So, actually the number will be 999 nine, nine. in the end 9 and 0 and these are how many 9s? 19 times 9. The question is the sum of digits. So, when you try to find the sum of these digits, it will be simply sum of digits of this number is equal to 19 times 9 and a 0 in the end, right? So that is equal to 171. So answer of this question, 171, very simple.